Meow. Meow. Hi, it's Penny Bowden, crazy cat artist here. Locking in the shapes of this lovely ball of floof. And I'm going four times the speed here and voicing over that muzzle and ears in there. Just general shapes and not worrying about being a little bit too messy. Uh, I'll, I'll fix that as I go. All the extra lines will fade away into background tone. Just checking my measurements a little. The shapes and angles are so important at this stage. Get that muzzle, the eye line. And we'll pop those eyes in there. And I ended up feeling like they were too high, so I'm gonna move them down a bit. It's always a work in progress, correcting as I go. I love to hear from you, so please drop me a comment. Tell me about yourself or your cat or whatever. Tell me what you wanna learn about cat drawing, where you live in the world. How many cats you have? Help us build this lovely community of crazy cat artists. I like the eyes better there. I'm happy with the facial features now. Pop those pupils in. And I really like the kind of smug look I've got on Kitty's face here. Catitude. I wonder what Kitty is thinking. The slightest little change in line in the facial area just makes such a difference in expression and actually it can throughout the whole body too. I try to reflect that in the body. Suggestion of hair here and there. Notice I don't draw every hair, I just basically draw the hairdo. I'd love to hear what kind of position you'd like to draw cats in. Lots of people have given me good ideas. Just suggestions of hair, floof, whatever you want to call it, here and there. Thank you so much for watching today. Got lots more videos to come especially with your suggestions. And we'll see you next time.